Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. Subscribe if you didn't and put the bell on so it can notify you every time I upload. And for this video, I am going to play with this Maybelline eyeshadow palette in the palette, the, the, <laughs> I keep saying, um, brush, nudes, blush nudes. And these are eyeshadows. You will see this palette. You will see a look. And keep on watching. So beauty, we're going to start off. I really primed my lids because I need a primer. And because this palette does not have a setting powder. And I like to set my eyes. So... Yeah, like, they're all, like, matte and shimmer. So this one's the shimmer, and I can't use that. I can't use the shimmer as a, uh, uh, eyeshadow base. So I am going to use this e.l.f. technique. e.l.f. Um, translucent. Um, thing with you. Sand powder, whatever you want to. So then I am going to use, and... Really professional gray contour. Like, so this is for concealer, but I use it as setting palette because it, um, see, my eyelids are small, so I blink, they close, and it's easy to get all over the lid. So, yeah. So then, now we're going to get started is, I'm going to take this light pink shade. So I'm going to take that shade, and I am going to use an, I'm going to use an Eagle Tools Double Ending Brush, and I'm going to use this side of the brush, the blending side. So then I'm gonna choose that shade just to give color to my eyes. Nothing big, you only pat it on. But if you want you could pat it on. So then I'm gonna use See, they're all like shimmers, and there's no mattes in here, and I hate that, but I'm going to create a look because not all of them look shimmer, like they look shimmer on the palette, but they don't look shimmer on the eyes, so I am going to create a look for you guys. So I am going to use a beauty, beauty professional brush, and then this is a... A create a melon color, so I am gonna use that brown, that dark brown. So I'm telling you guys. These are like there's no mats in here, it's a blonde. And I'm not mad about this palette, but I also don't love it. Like, it's not my favorite. There's other good quality eyeshadows. But you can't all have like shimmers and one mat. Like you need at least like two or three mats. But what can I do? So then I am going to use these two colors as shimmers. This is like a light green. And this is a silver. What do you want to call it? 
cover some Morphine M67 brush and I am gonna use the first shade that's the first color set and I am gonna use them. And I am gonna put that in the inner towards the outer but I like to pat it on there. Just like halfway, and you want to pat a lot on there. Okay, so then I'm gonna use the um, Eagle Tools brush. I'm gonna use this side. I'm gonna use this color right here. Or the shade, or you want to call it. And you just. So you wanna start off. Where, like, where you ended the last one. So, the last one I showed you, you want to start up there. And just put it on there. Okay, so that's it. So I am going to, again, go in this, with this brush. Use the brown shade that I use. And just put product on there. And then just blend everything out. So that's that. Yes, I use my hands. My hands are clean. So then, that's that for the eyeshadow. So then, next up in the sky, and this is the CoverGirl Love Volume Mascara. So this is like one of my first mascaras and I love it. So then for the last step and the final step is lip gloss and this is the Maybelline Super Stay Matte Ink and then this is in the shade fifty.
So, this is the color. This is, that's what I do. I don't line my lips. Sometimes they are perfect, sometimes they're not. Okay. Okay, so for now, uh, now I'm gonna show you swatches, and this is how it's gonna go. I'm gonna do the first row, and now I'm gonna do the second row. So the first color is, I'm gonna the first shade is just like white, like you could use as your brown bone, that's why I forgot. And put on your brow bone. A little sprinkle to your eyes. So then I'm gonna swatch the shade. You're not gonna see anything, you're just gonna see white. And then the next is just like shimmer. Um, not, it's light pink, but not pink. It's like a peach color. And you're not going to see that color either. And then this is the green that I used. I think I'm not going to like, I'm going to try it. See if it works when I use my finger. If it lights up. Ooh. Pretty. Okay, so now I know the trick. Use your finger. And just pat it on there. I feel like the brush absorbs it, so yes, I'm going to swatch it for you guys. It's like a green. Oh, you guys can't see it, that's what I'm saying, this palette. This palette is shitty. But, like, I think like, I could work with it, like, I don't mind, but it's shitty. So, this one is like a pink one, shimmer. I feel like they're not shimmers, but then they act like they are shimmers. Ugh, so annoying. So then I have this one that I used, the first shade. And this is like a purple and pink together. So then the next, I um, mean the next shade is that like I don't even know how to explain it to you, so I'm gonna swatch that for you. And then we're going to the second row, and that's just, this color is really pretty. Like, some of these colors are really pretty, but not all of them. So I am gonna swatch this gold for you. It's like a gold. Brown. And then I'm gonna swatch the second color I used. So this color is pigmented. And then I'm gonna swatch this color. This like last color I used. Well, the second to last one. I really like how my swatches came out, but there's still like I don't recommend this palette. There's better pa there's better palettes out there. But hey, if you're interested, go ahead, go spend your money on this palette. So then the next color is this like. Dark brown, I mean dark brown, dark silver. And then I'm gonna swatch 
watch is like maroon red. That's what I call it. I think it's like a maroon red. Or maroon. Whatever you want to call it. But it's like a rose color. That's what. And that, like the last, this one's also pretty. But like, I don't know if I recommend this. But... And then the last color is this black one right there. It's like a dark purple. So that's not. So that's the swatches, like, you know, I don't think you can see the swatches, they're like, barely. So, you guys, this is not my favorite palette, but I'm showing you guys some palettes work, some palettes don't. I don't use this on daily, I don't use it, I don't pick it up as often. Um, I don't recommend it, like, it just, the color is so light, so, like, I don't know, I don't know how to tell you. Yes, they are, like, like, the top row is the only problem with me, because the lightest colors ever, and they don't show up. But these, they show up, but they don't, like, show up, so we're going to see if the, if, if it works with the finger, like, I did the second to last color. So you show it up. I think it did. So yeah, like I'm saying, like I think you should like the Bella palette, better palettes out there. And I'm not saying, oh, don't love Morphe. I love Morphe's palette, Morphe's product. I have their primer. You guys know I love their primer. I love their lipstick, matte lipstick. I had their foundation I love. Um, I love that highlight, the metallic highlight. Um, Wild Wild from Morphe. I don't have a lot, but I do have that, and I love their lipstick. Whoop! That's how you know I love because it fell on my hand. And that's it. I have my. I use. I use. I also have mascara from Morphe. And it, it's good. But the only problem is I feel like the eyeshadows are not that good. Like, they're the new ones that I didn't try, but I heard they only have shimmers, like one matte and sh rust shimmers. Like, we need more matte, like, mix it up, put like matte and shimmers. Or you, you have this palette that's, that's kind of how many eyeshadows are in here together. So, two, four, six, eight, ten. 12 so 12 eyeshadow and you only have one matte and they're all the other shimmer but you can use them as mattes as well i'm telling you the um the the brown and the dark brown one they use that's matte that's that's literally matte to me not shimmer they just add like a little shimmer but it's matte and that's it for the video. You guys know I love Morphe. Morphe is like my favorite palette. Like my favorite brand. So is Wet n Wild. And you guys know I love Wet n Wild. So comment down below what next video you guys want to see. And I will do a Get Ready With Me video. Soon. Um, Because. I'm going to get soon. Just because I can't do one now. I did this look so it doesn't like make sense but I am going to do a get ready with me in future video because I guys want to tell you what's my favorite part my uh jewelry and stuff like that I'm putting I'm going to put no content out there and tell your friend tell anyone and I will see you next week love you guys